Okay, this is the easiest way to add custom text tones or custom ringtones to your iPhone. It could be iPhone 4, 4S, 3G, whatever, uh, as long as you have iOS 5 or higher. This is just the easiest, most simplest way, period. Open up iTunes, add file, folder, whatever you want to add. Find a sound file that you have saved from internet, you know, whatever, anything. Uh, this one right here, click on it. It's going to appear in my iTunes right here. Um, Basically, if you want to edit it to a ringtone or a text tone, go to options. Make sure you have your start time and your stop time and edit it to where you want it. For instance, I don't really care where this is. Say I want it to start at 28 or 18 seconds and end at 50 seconds, 40 seconds, just to say it's a ringtone or something. Click OK. It'll save it like that. Now right click it and click create AAC version. If it says create AIFF version or something. You'll have to do it a little differently, but what it'll do is save it right here, right below it, 22 seconds. Uh, go to File or Edit Preferences, uh, General Import Settings, and Import Using, and change it to AAC if it's on anything else. And then uh, basically, right here is pretty much that. You click a uh, right click on it. You're gonna go to Delete. It's going to ask you to keep files, click yes. You're going to keep files now. What I do is uh, it should save it in like music or anything like that. So all you have to do is search for it again. And uh, for instance, mine's right there. So what I'm going to do is just uh, grab it. Grab it to the desktop. It's going to be right there now. And all you have to do is change it to from M4A. Because you're going to find the M4A file after you delete it. And... Uh, Change from M4A, you can't really see it on here, but to M4R. Press enter, it'll ask you blah blah blah, it might become unusable. Say yes. Okay, so it's right there. And all you're gonna do now is go back to your iTunes, uh, new, add file to library, go to that one you just made, which should be on the desktop if you did it. Uh, right click on it, or click on it, click open. It should automatically open up into your ringtone, for instance, it's right there now and then sync your phone and there you go you now have it on your ringtones in there and uh... with ios 5 you can actually change it your, to uh... any text tone or anything like that also so you don't have to do anything custom you just go to text tone to change it and uh... yeah that's about it Peace.